right, get ready. Today, we wrap up our You in the Q week with a lesson on how yoga can help with that narcissistic stress in your back, as Kelly mentioned <laughs> earlier. <laughs> From the, <laughs> tell Barry I, I said hello. From the yeah, popular YouTube channel, Yoga with Adrian, which has over 7 million subscribers and counting. Please welcome Yogi and YouTube sensation, Adrian Mishler. Adrian, we have stress and pain in our lower backs. What do we do about it? Hi guys, such a pleasure to be on with you. Well, the thing about yoga that I really love is it kind of checks all the boxes, in my opinion. So you can tend to your physical body, but you can also tend to you know, your mental health, your emotional wellness. So I like to say, and it's kind of cheesy, but yoga has your back and it really does. Like all of it, all parts, tends to all, all the things, which is really good right now um, because there's so many options. Um, as we're at home, you know, online navigating, what should I do? How can I get the most out of this 15 minutes I have for myself? And I think yoga is a really good option. I've got to tell you, I'm looking behind you and it looks like, do you live in a peaceful yoga retreat? <laughs> it looks like you're, you live in a yoga retreat. In a yoga spa. Yeah. Well, the funny thing is, um, I, I do shoot, people ask me all the time, is, is that really your house? Do you shoot the YouTube channel, the videos in your real home? Or is that like um, a stage? And I'm like, no, it's my real home. But the unique thing about this is in order to get the natural light, uh, as opposed to, you know, setting up lights, and whatnot, we're actually doing the reverse of what people normally see on the YouTube channel. So it's kind of like fun and special and a little meta. But yeah, this is a dining room turned yoga room. There is a dining room table, which of course is hosting a puzzle right now, naturally. Of course, um, yeah, it should. Of course. <laughs> so what, what, um, what, yeah. Kelly and I, I think we're ready for some poses. What poses can we try? All right, well, ready. my, my it's okay if if you just want to watch that's fine too because we're just going to kind of put put it in our brains and into anyone who's watching brain that a little goes a long way sometimes we think we have to do like a full power yoga or you know there's the whole thing about the pretzel -y shapes you don't need me to tell you that you know but sometimes the simple things really make a big difference so i'm going to show you a couple things particularly for the back but ultimately they're going to help create a healthy flow of energy uh, for the body Okay. All right. Okay. I'm in my yoga gear. Benji, do you want to come I here? Come on. This is my assistant, Benji. Oh, oh Georgia. Hi, Benji. Come here. Can you show us This is my assistant, Georgia. <laughs> oh, good, good yoga. Yes, that's really good funny. Good yoga. So the first one is, is I'm going to lean towards Benji here. I'm going to use what I have. It's just a standing forward fold. Okay. So we're going to okay. step the feet nice and wide. And it's great. I mean, you can do these in Stan Smiths. You can do this in jeans. You can do this in between, you know, work moments. You can do this in the kitchen. But I'm going to suggest a deep bend in the knees to really target that lower back. And then should I do it? In, can I do it in boxer shorts? Because that's what I'm wearing right now. <laughs> yes. Actually, that's encouraged. You know, we can also do this in a chair. If someone is a little less mobile. We can do this in the chair. We're still getting that low back love. We're waking up the hamstrings. And then we're also getting the head slightly below the heart, just creating a healthy flow of energy. So we just take a deep breath here. Okay. And you also can kind of tell how tight you are in the shoulders when we kind of flip it upside down, just getting some fresh blood flow. And then maybe bending the knees a little more. Knees, yep. Yeah. Oh! Yeah. And then the knees. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then the last bit is maybe clasping opposite elbow with opposite hand and just using that little bind to rock a little side to side. Oh yeah, that's a good one. I always, I always oh. do that sitting up. By the way, I always like clasp my arms. <laughs> <laughs> and then Ryan, what was that sound? Down the what? What was that sound? Did did George just swallow your mic? <laughs> Yeah, that was Georgia licking me or the sound of my back popping. Not quite sure. Oh, yeah. It sounded loud. All right, so now you're on the floor. You're on the mat. Now we're on the mat, and, you know, it's kind of hard to go from standing to the mat. Sometimes I, I, I mean, I do this for a living, and 
the hardest part really is showing up. So this may seem extremely basic, but I just find it so valuable. And really the hardest part is just like getting on the ground. Excuse me, buddy. Sorry, my love. Okay. He's the, the real master here. And then just going for some spinal flexion. You probably know we call this cat cow. We inhale to drop the belly and look forward. And then we exhale around the spine and draw it up. And it seems so simple, but if we really synchronize with the breath here, we're really getting the most out of the spinal flexion, also kind of calming the busy brain, nice and easy. And then I like to say, find what feels good. So you start with this structure and then you can kind of veer off the railroad tracks and check in with your side body, tight tightness in the shoulders. Mm. That's it. Do you, do, you, do you know what I'm realizing? Yeah. Uh, she has such a sense of calm and peacefulness that we yeah. should try and figure out how to have ourselves, right? Very zen, <laughs> very calm, very centered. Okay. This show would never get off the ground if we had any zen or calm or if peace. If we had any, exactly, exactly. <laughs> we, uh, so let's do this. We're going to put uh, <laughs> some of these tips up on our website so that we can uh, get those for people who are watching now. Thank you so much for coming on. Great to spend uh, some peaceful time together. Oh, thank you so much. It's an honor and a pleasure. And yeah, we have tons of free videos on YouTube so people can practice yoga at home.